Hi guys, my name is Greena Jemskal and welcome to a walkthrough of The Sims Free Play The Hidden Unicorn Quest. The quest unlocks at level 14 and it's part of the main quests in Sims Free Play. That means that you will it might be after level 14 by the time you get round to doing this quest, but all the main quests have to be done in a certain order and once it, this quest becomes available to you, you will get this pop-up. There is a limited time on this of 3 days. And the pop-up says a magnificent beast has appeared in Simtown. Follow the magical unicorn and the show jumping hobby will be yours. So as I say, we have three days and that means that there is a limited time prize. If we complete it within the three days, we will win this wondrous unicorn rocking horse for toddlers. And just by completing the quest, we will discover the secrets of the unicorn and you'll open the gate to the show jumping hobby. So we'll unlock the show jumping hobby by completing this quest. The first thing we need to do is to inspect show jumping gate. Your sims have a hankering to do some show jumping and the field to the right at the stables would be a perfect place. Investigate the lock on the gate at the stables. So you will need to go over to Mystery Island. So click on the Mystery Island tab and go into the stables. Once you're over at the stables, you're going to have to go into Sim Tracker and whistle a sim over. And then click on the show jumping gate, which is this one over here. Task complete, inspect show jumping gates, so that completes instantly. Show jumping hobby gate. This is the show jumping paddock. Once it has been cleared and fixed, you can teach your horse to leap over hurdles with grace and poise. Note, three star horses are required for this hobby. Okay, so the next thing that we need to do for this quest is to investigate horse. Your sim doesn't know who locked the gate, but it's going to take incredible power to open it. Wait, is that a horse near the lake? What's it doing there? Have a sim investigate the horse near the lake at the stables. So here we go, this horse here, this unicorn horse. Go ahead and click and investigate the horse for 14 seconds. We have investigated the horse. Now we need to check Unicorn's horn. Your sim can't believe their eyes. Is that a unicorn? A real live sparkly unicorn? Have your sim check its horn to make sure it's real. So we'll click on the unicorn again and inspect horn takes 24 seconds. There we go, we have checked the unicorn's horn. Now we need to talk to the unicorn. Wow, that's definitely a real unicorn. It looks like it has something to say. So talk to it. Let's click on the unicorn again and talk to the unicorn for two minutes. Whilst your sim is talking to the unicorn, I recommend if you've got another sim spare, we will need to bake Rocky Road later on in this quest and you can start that early. So I would suggest that you do that now. So, so go ahead and click on your oven and go into baking and then find Rocky Road. Where is it? There we go, Rocky Road for 12 hours. The thing you need to make sure you do is don't come back into this house before the Rocky Road task comes up within the quest because otherwise you'll have to do it all over again. We have talked to the unicorn. Now we need to go ahead and go home and call a friend. The unicorn didn't speak in the way that most sims do but spoke of candy and rainbows. Your sim needs to tell their friends about this immediately. Have them call a friend on the phone from home. So let's go back home. So we are back at home. We need to call a friend for five minutes. This is only a one star phone, so you will be able to do that quicker if you've got a more expensive phone. But I'm just gonna do the one star for five minutes. We have finished the call to our friend. Now we need to call two sims to the stables. Now that your sim's friend knows about the unicorn, they can't wait to see it. Bring two of your sims to the stables. So back over at the stables, just go ahead and whistle two sims over using the sim tracker and that is completed. Now we need to laugh with Sim. The unicorn is gone. Your Sim covered up the embarrassment of the unicorn's absence by telling their friend that it hoofed it. Have your Sims laugh together at this hilariously bad joke. So laugh with Sim for five minutes. We have laughed with a Sim. Now we need to investigate a tree. Now that your Sims have finished drying their eyes from the unicorn joke, one of them has spotted something sparkly in one of the trees near the lake. Have a Sim investigate a tree near the lake at the stables. It has got an exclamation mark on it for you, so it is easy to find. Go ahead and click on it and investigate for 2 minutes and 12 seconds. We've finished investigating the tree. 
Now we need to talk to a sim about unicorn. Hmm, the tree has some kind of glitter in it. This can only be the work of a unicorn, but your sim doesn't know where it went. Time to get some help. Talk to another sim about the unicorn. We have already got another sim over at the stable, so if you haven't, just go ahead and whistle one over. Talk about unicorns there, top right, for 1 minute and 30 seconds. We finished our little chat to another sim about the unicorn. The next thing we need to do is to look up unicorns on a computer. The sim hasn't seen the unicorn, but it did suggest checking the internet for more clues. Have your sim look up unicorns on a computer. So we need to go ahead and head home. So once back at home, whistle over a sim. And on the computer, look up unicorns for 17 minutes. I said before about not coming back over to this house where we are baking Rocky Road. It's okay to come over to the house whilst they are still actually doing the baking, but it's just once it's complete, don't come over to the house until the task comes up. We have looked up unicorns on a computer. Now we need to talk to a sim about shy unicorns. According to the wondrous internet, unicorns are magical creatures that like to meet people, but are also terribly shy. Have your sim ask another sim about how unicorns cope with shyness. So in the sim tracker, whistle over a sim and then click on your other sim. Talk about shy unicorns for 2 minutes and 30 seconds, top right. We finished talking to a sim about shy unicorns. The next thing we need to do is to read Pooping Rainbows. Your sim's friend saw a great book on the subject of unicorns. It also had a special chapter all about shyness. Check it out. Go read Pooping Rainbows. It's in a bookshelf. So I have a two-star bookshelf here and to read Pooping Rainbows on this bookshelf is eight minutes and six seconds. We've read Pooping Rainbows. Now we need to talk to a sim about the unicorn. According to the book, Pooping Rainbows, unicorns love to jump. What if the unicorn was waiting at the stables because it loves show jumping, but your sim came and scared it away? Perhaps they can coax it back with some sort of food. Talk to another sim about what unicorns eat. So let's click on our other sim and talk about unicorns for 1 minute 30 seconds. We've finished talking to the sim about the unicorn. Now we need to bake Rocky Road. Your sim's friend had the answer. Unicorns eat Rocky Road, of course. Bake some Rocky Road to lure the unicorn with. So we have already got our Rocky Road on the go over here. If you haven't already got it doing, obviously go to a cooker, go into baking and bake Rocky Road. The Rocky Road has finished baking. Now we need to call a sim to the stables. Great, the rocky road is ready and it's time to lure that unicorn out of its hiding. Have a sim go to the stables now. So head on over to Mystery Island and then into the stables. Oh, I already had somebody over at the stables, but if you haven't already got somebody over to the stables, just go ahead and use the sim tracker to whistle them over. Now we need to leave the rocky road for the unicorn. Your sim can see the perfect spot to put the rocky road near the show jumping gate. Have a sim place the rocky road near the gate. X marks the spot. So it is taking you over to where you need to go. And just click on it and leave rocky road for 12 seconds. We go and left the rocky road for the unicorn. Now we need to wait for the unicorn. The trap is set, so all your sim needs to do now is wait. Have your sim wait behind a tree near the lake and wait for the unicorn to return. So we need to go back over to the lake. And again, you've got an exclamation mark to help you out where to go if you're unsure. Click on the tree and wait for unicorn for 12 hours and 30 minutes. We have finished that long wait for the unicorn. The next thing to do is to have a deep sleep. <gasps> There's the unicorn, but it looks too shy to come out and eat the rocky road. Your sim thinks they should leave so the unicorn can eat in peace. Why not have them get a little rest while they're at it? Have your sim go for a deep sleep in a bed. So we need to head on home. So back at home, we have a three-star bed and a deep sleep is six hours and 30 minutes. We'll start that now. We have finished our deep sleep. Now we need to go to the stables. Great, a good sleep is just what your sim needed. Oh wait, the unicorn. I wonder how it's doing. Go back to the stables. So head on back over to the island and then once over at the island find your stables and go into the stables and that should be task complete. No we need to call a sim over. So call a sim over and that is task complete. Go to the stables. Now we need to read the note. Oh look the unicorn left and he ate the rocky road. 
and he unlocked the show jumping gate. Wow, is that a note near the gate? Have a sim read the note near the show jumping gate. X marks the spot. So we've got an X over here by the show jumping gate and an exclamation mark just in case you were unsure. And that is read note for one minute. We have finished reading the note. Now we need to repair the show jumping gate. The note was from the unicorn. It said, thank you for the rocky road. In return, I've unlocked the show jumping gate. I must overcome my shyness, but I will return when the time is right. Incredible. <laughs> Tap on the show jumping gate to repair it. So here is the show jumping gate right where the note was. Click on it. And that takes eight hours, costs 50,000 simoleons. This is the show jumping paddock. Once it has been cleared and fixed, you can teach your horse to leap over hurdles with grace and poise. It will add a town value of 100,000. So let's go ahead and repair that for eight hours. We have finished repairing the show jumping gate. You can see it's now flashing green. So just go ahead and click on it and that is task complete. And congratulations, you followed the rainbow teachings of the unicorn. And in turn, you've gained access to the show jumping area for your sims. Congratulations, you've gained access to the most sparkly rainbow charged rocking horse of all, a unicorn rocking horse. So that is our limited time prize for completing it within the three days. We'll go and take a little look at that now. So as I've just seen, for completing the quest, we get access to the show jumping hobby, which is of course done within the stables. To start the show jumping hobby though, you do have to clear up this whole area here, which you can do by bringing as many sims over as you can spare and just, by, just start by clearing up all of this mess. You will also have to have completed the other horse hobbies before you can do the show jumping hobbies. The horse hobbies are kind of quite complicated, I think, when you're first starting out with it and kind of trying to get your head around how it all works and everything. But yeah, we have unlocked the show jumping hobby with this quest. The time for completing the quest within the limited time period is the rocking horse, which is 1,500. You'll find it in the toddler section of the home store. It is a nice prize, but we already do have a rocking horse, so I wouldn't stress too much about completing this within the time limit. There are three different options there, as you can see, for a toddler to use this. It's a sweet little interaction for the toddlers to do, and it gives them some of their fun need. But, like I say, yeah, it's, we've already got a rocking horse, so it's not massive if you don't manage to do it in time. The next quest that becomes available to us is the In The Clubhouse quest. As soon as you are able to do it, you will get this pop-up. It says, not that long ago, in a magical place far, far away, a toddler dreamed of a playhouse where they could have make-believe adventures. But if you've got any questions about this quest, do leave them down below. Either myself or another simmer can maybe try and help you out. I'll also leave a link to my blog post about this quest down below in the top line of the description. You can go ahead and check that out if you would like. But thank you so much for watching this video. I hope it has helped you out. Subscribe to the channel if you are new and I will see you guys soon for a new video. Bye.